Ich freue mich sehr, euch heute Abend unserer Veranstaltung Power to the People, Werbung im 21. Jahrhundert zu begrüßen. Wir hier glauben an das viel zitierte Märkte sind Kommunikation. Und Kommunikation findet nicht mehr isoliert allein über klassische Medien statt, sondern mehr und mehr im direkten Dialog mit den Menschen. Deshalb Power to the People, deshalb Bus Marketing, die Menschen zu Gesprächen, zur Kommunikation zu bewegen. It's no more about conversation, it's not about conversation. Advertising is still really interrupting people, pushing message in your face, and that the people are fed up with it. And that in a, any normal other relationship, people would just have reacted very bad to that. So there is a problem of credibility too. 76% of consumers don't believe that companies tell the truth in advertising. So that's a problem, you know, if you spend tons of money to basically say it's the best car, the best movie, you know, after a while people just know the truth. Of course it is not only best car and best movie uh, in the world. And they are changing opinions, they are sending recommendations to each other and they listen less and less to the big advertising. Okay, this is more what's going on now, like, you know, like people surfing at the same time, watching TV, talking together, listening uh, to the radio or the hype at the same time. And basically, between Web2, what is important is poor to the people. Poor to the people. It's the name for the part tonight, but it's really that. Today, people, like normal people, like you and me, we have more power sometimes than brands and businesses. We have tools in our hands that let us communicate and uh, co collaborate together than, uh, uh, like never before. And Time elected the person of the year, you, uh, for, for this year, just to say basically you have more possibilities and are in power like never before. So basically, people can create their own TV, their own magazines, their own reportage, their own radio. So they are becoming mini-media. They are becoming media themselves. And of course, Web2 is about collaboration too. It's very easy to be connected to people, you know, MySpace, Facebook, uh, Xim here in Germany, more for uh, professional networking. You are connected to people, you exchange information. Uh, it's all about generating content together, Wikipedia, for example. Wikipedia is the 10th biggest website in the world. Have you an idea about how many people uh, uh, the company, which is a foundation by the way, is employed? Any guess? Who vote for 100? Okay, who vote for 200? Okay, so basically it's 11 people. They have 11 people and they manage the 10th biggest website in terms of audience. So it just shows now it's not only about being the bigger or the one with more money, but if you are smart enough to make your customer, make the user collaborate with you, you can have a, a, a huge impact. Uh, there are over 106 million registered user in MySpace, now I think we're more than 200 in 2007. So it means in 2006, to give you another comparison, if MySpace were a country, it would have been the 11th largest country in the world. So just give you like, when I hear some brands who tell me, you know, our blog and all this stuff, it's interesting, I will see that later. It's already there, it's already big, it's already interesting in terms of audience. So even in terms of impact, 25% uh, of Europeans trust blogs for their choices. Doesn't mean they trust everything they read, but at least they listen, they read, they check, they search, even to buy in an offline shop, they are going to check what has been said about this car, about this computer, by other users. It's exactly when you go on Amazon, if you say 10 recommendations were negative about a book, you're probably not going to buy it, because you trust the other people's opinion. Uh, interesting one because uh, uh, it's really using the surprise effect and I think people know finally you're not only competing for the attention of people against other adver advertising, you are competing against all the other entertainment. People have the choice to listen to your advertising or watch something else on the TV or on the internet. So you need to be surprising, entertaining, create impact. Uh, finally, Web2 is a lot about giving. The more you give, the more you are credible. Like in the ancient world, the more you keep the information, the more powerful you were. Now it's all about giving. The more you publish content, interesting content, it's what we do on cultivers.de uh, blog, uh, the more people know us, 
uh, trust us and finally are going to contact us for campaign. 